Hey yo guys, how is it going and welcome on back to a brand new video guys. We are on Mage PS yet again. I am bringing you guys a brand new content showcase video on literally one of the biggest custom servers out today. It's currently 11 o'clock at night for me and there's still over 100 players online, so good shit. But guys, in today's video, I will be taking a look at the Slayer rework update on Mage, going over how viable this can actually be and how great some of these new zones are and kind of showcase a new mini game game like thing very quickly guys i've got a 100 giveaway for today's video well it's actually 105 bucks but if you guys are interested please go ahead and like today's video you do comment your in-game name it down below go ahead and subscribe to the channel turning on the post notifications come check out mage ps click that link down below join my discord i do post giveaway winners in there as well as new videos and giveaways as well and yeah make sure you guys do watch through the entire video it supports the channel out a lot if you guys enjoy the content you're seeing i mean yeah i would just appreciate it because youtube's algorithm Rhythm kind of sucks. But yeah, guys, this Slayer update is fucking all this stuff. Here's a little sneak peek as well. Anyways, guys, enjoy the video. Have a great day. Bye. So you guys can actually start this off by talking to Duradel, and you guys can go ahead and do a couple of these zones. There are going to be three different zones from Duradel easy, medium, and the hard zone. How this will work is you guys will select the zone you want to go do. You'll go ahead and grind out the various amounts of bosses and NPCs, which also drop all of their loot tables, which is dope. And you guys will go for a full 100% bar. And once you fill it up, there will be a dragon that spawns. And you guys will fuck it up and get some loot. So I've actually already killed quite a few things in the medium cave. I've got all of my non-rare drops going into my bank, so I will be showcasing this loot after we go ahead and complete the entire cave and kill the dragon. And yeah, let's go ahead and start fucking up some some uh, slayer npcs so i've been calling calling slayer m or slayer e or slayer h for your preferred slayer zone and as you guys can see i'm gonna be in a nice little area a nice little arena i'm ready to go yeah, the npcs will start flooding in they're gonna start spawning like i literally saw like eight viragos on top of each other at once there was some kind of fucking orgy going down but but i killed them so let's go ahead and get this percentage bar all the way up to 100 percent kill the dragon get some loot and have a good day. Big boy Virago coming on in. Oh, I, I literally one shot Virago. Dude, my fucking bad, dude. My bad. But like I went ahead and mentioned earlier, there are going to be a bunch of NPCs that do spawn. So depending on which zone you actually choose, will be, you know, spawning different variations of NPCs and bosses. So for the medium zone, I've gotten a lot of Viragos, a lot of Corporal Beast, White Walkers, a couple of the Tri-Zone people, Tormented Demons, which all these guys are going to be hidden behind Colton Colton zones. And you guys will need a certain kill count of npcs or a certain requirement to actually go ahead and do damage to these bosses so if you're new to mage ps and you don't have that many zones unlocked or that many requirements done and completed i would definitely go ahead and start with the easy slayer zone as you just won't be able to kill that many npcs over at a medium or hard zone by the way, you can actually have multiple people at this zone while it's going on. So this guy just came here, so we're gonna go ahead and grind this shit out. Okay, dude, you know what? Screw Slayer Medium. I'm at the hard zone. It's already at 89%, so I'm gonna go ahead and fuck up some shit over here. Dude, I'm ready to go. This is gonna be dope as fuck. Dude, there are so many more bosses here and so much more HP on all these. I could possibly die. I'm not 100% sure, but with all these guys hitting me at once, it's kind of fucking scary. But uh, yeah, these guys have a bunch of HP. We've got Diablos, we've got Blood Cerberus, we've got Krills. We do we have so much stuff here? Hey, my boy came over here as well. He's gonna help me on out. And let's get this 100%. Kill the dragon, save the queen, get the loot, and uh. Yeah. Yo, boys, we are coming up on that 100% on the Slayer hard zone. I'm actually pretty fucking excited, dude. I'm ready to fight this dragon. I'm ready to get some loot. And, oh, shit, Rage Virago. What's going on, buddy? Oh, he's dead. Oh, shit, guys, 100%. Where is the dragon? Is it spawn in the middle? Oh, shit. Yo, that is so fucking cool, dude. The golden dragon has just spawned at the hard zone. He's over here in the middle. Can I drag him out? Oh, wait, can I not move once I'm in here? I'm fucking stuck. I think from that Rage Virago kill, I got an extremely flaming katana as a rare drop. Oh, shit. So let's go ahead and kill this golden dragon. I don't think it pops up in the chat when you summon it or spawn it. Oh, it does. Okay, dope. So yeah, once you guys get 100%, the dragon will spawn. Oh, shit, there's the katana. 500 trill? 
Uh, boys, I just made fucking bank. Oh, I'm making bank from killing these NPCs. Holy shit. Black Deathful Kite Shield. But dude, we went ahead and killed the Golden Dragon. We did not get any drops. It just kind of feels bad. Nothing rare, nothing too insane. But here's a bunch of the drops I did get from the other floors. So we got a bunch of just like, you know, items, drops from all the NPCs that we went ahead and took out. Bunch of keys, bunch of boxes, bunch of one bill tickets or tokens. She got two pretty rare items worth almost 700 trill. So guys, with the Slayer rework, they were trying to make it more viable for people to actually enjoy. And with this came the three new zones, which is also very, very dope. Three bosses, a bunch of NPCs to kill, and they also added a brand new Gilded Helmet and a reason to actually go for it, and the combination. You can make a brand new Hydra Armor. This is also the first hybrid set to Mage. As you guys can see, we've also got ourselves three of these sets, Melee, Ranged, and Magic. And then this one being the hybrid one. These look pretty fucking dope, and going for the Gilded Slayer Helmet is very, very useful as well. The normal Gilded Slayer Helmet will give you a 25% damage boost, and you guys can add attachments from, like, the Golden Black Dragon, which will give it a 50%. Hydra sets, another 50% as well. And explaining the final boss fight from these zones, the Golden Black Dragon, which can be found in all three of the actual caves, and then each zone will give you a drop from either being easy for melee, medium, for ranged and then hard being for magic so let's go ahead and showcase these brand new gears from the slayer rework we've got the full slayer hydra set which does look very very clean in game i am holding my extremely uh, flaming katana as well we've also got the melee ranged and a magic of the gilded slayer helmets which do give you some pretty nice bonuses we've got the full magic set with the staff looking very very clean with the magic helmet on as well the appearance of the helmets don't really change but they do you know obviously give you those bonuses here is going to be the range set i'm a huge fan of this one i love the fucking bow has like the dragon's head on it very very unique and then we've got the melee set up with the sword as well looking fucking sick but yeah this update is pretty dope i'm a huge fan of slayer reworks i'm a huge fan of custom slayer in general but guys i'm doing a pretty juicy giveaway for over 100 on today's video two halloween boxes split the two comments down below so one each and then we got a magical box going to the first non-edited comments if you guys are interested on today's video please go ahead and like today's video you do comment your in-game name down below go ahead and subscribe to the youtube channel turning on my post bell notifications join my discord link will be down below hop on mage join mage's discord and yeah have a great day thank you all for watching i'll see you guys in the next video